We're here in basically downtown Tahlequah in the branch that runs through Tahlequah through all the parks in here and down towards NSU. But this creek has still got a lot of traditional foods around it, traditional things that we gathered. Um, we're here with our class, the uh, Cherokee Language Master Apprentice Program. These are the third year cohorts. In North Carolina, they say Sochan. In Oklahoma, all the Cherokees here say Kochan or Kochun but Kochan is a wild edible. It's usually good to get it about this time of year. Uh, so spring, early, early summer, that time period right in there. It usually grows close to a creek. Its stalk is, it kind of looks like, almost like celery, like really skinny celery. And at the bottom where celery turns white, that turns red. But the leaves are kind of sharp looking, almost jagged. Usually they get the whole, either the whole plant from the stalk all the way down to the ground or the, where it meets the ground. They'll break it off right there if it's tender enough. Sometimes they'll just break it about halfway, midway through and get the tops off of it. The way I've had it is a couple of different ways. Sometimes they'll wilt them down till they're really, really soft and just eat it like a wilted green. Sometimes they'll just blanch them. You boil them down a little bit or you, or you fry them a little bit, but not enough to make it too soft so it still has a little bit of a crunch to it and then you can flavor it kind of however you want in any direction you want you can add sweet things to it if you wanted to people are doing that these days a long time ago probably just salt and pepper and maybe a little bacon grease it's good for all kinds of stuff not just to eat but medicine wise it's good for your body helps you i think wild greens in general or just gathering uh, for our people has been something that we've always done and it never ceased. I think that everything in, in Cherokee, in, in our language, is, is better represented when it's talked about in our language. So these things that are traditions to us can be talked about a lot in English and we can say all kinds of things about them, but the importance and the value of it doesn't really come across unless you're using the language. If you're using the language, that thing becomes much more important. A guy who chico amayus taline oju oju hiloja oju hiloja um oji kahal kochun uh so um a wojitlag julask uh sag um go uh uanista uh Plague Ganist, Plague Ganist, uh, those uh, Judelena, Judelena Gohust, Mochi Plug, Asuyag, um, uh, no Ojik.